check the city. I don't even know if you can tell what city this is. Probably some people can. Uh, we're in New Orleans right now. I know I originally did say I'm supposed to pick up the Corvette in Miami, but that would have meant a night in Miami, probably a night in Tampa, a night in like Tallahassee. That's three days and nights in Florida which I'm really not down for, I don't have the time for that. So I got the car shipped to here in New Orleans. I've never been here before. Turned up last night, it was so dope. Like the city really doesn't sleep Saturday night. I think there's a thing called Essence Festival here right now too, which made it super more lit. But we're about to head to the dealership right now and pick up my car. I've been waiting a year and a half for this moment. Let's do it, hurry. All right, well, bad news. The dealership's closed on Sundays. I didn't know this, but I we have one hope. When the car landed, they hooked me up with the app and everything. And it says my car and my VIN on there and everything. So they said I can remote start it. So hopefully, oh, I don't know. Oh my God. If I can just start the car, just find it in the lot. And that'd be awesome. I can name my car. What? Jane. Mary Jane. <laughs> don't look so upset over there. Not, Why do you look like, so mad? I'm thinking. I feel like you're not going to be able to get it because they lock the lot. Oh, start, stop your engine, lock, unlock your doors. Sound the horn, flash your lights. Oh, bro. I'm so fucking pumped. Please let me start it from my app. Dude, I'll bust through that fucking gate. I don't give a fuck if there's a gate, bro. Hell no. You're all set up. Thank you for choosing Chevrolet. Now enjoy your ride. Oh, shit. Right, we have arrived at the dealership. I do not see it. I just thought about it. I don't think you can even drive the car from the app. You might just be able to start it and like unlock it and stuff. Which, <laughs> god damn it. Um, it might be even inside too. Um, I don't see it, but we can honk the horn. Your alarm is on. Well, I don't think we'll be able to get it today, dude. <laughs> no! Thank you so much. You're welcome. Fresh out the hotel check-ins, my first time in New Orleans. In fact, I'm wearing this shirt. Hey, show them the shirt, show them the shirt. Can you see it? Can you see it? I'm gonna drive it to Houston next, and then San Antonio. So it's gonna be a good amount of content. Then we're going to, you know, Arizona and fucking Vegas. So it's gonna be a good amount of content. I'm excited. I've been waiting a year and a half for this moment right here. So please, no more waiting. So where are you from? Uh, from Texas. Yes, sir. You will get me in the video? If you want to be, you know. What? <laughs> 1931, we've been in Wow, place. right here in New Orleans? Yep. Damn, that's awesome. But you know, you're quite lucky because oh. the delivery driver, it wasn't a good situation, man. He oh, just really? dropped it off and Got you. anybody could have taken it. Right, Literally, yeah. it could have gotten stolen. Right, yeah. It was very sketchy. Thank you, sir. I appreciate I'm just, that. It, it was real sketchy the yeah, way you yeah. did it. Okay, gosh, you're sorry about that, man. Like, it could have gotten damaged. I didn't yeah. look at it. So, whose fault is that? I don't know. It was right, right, yeah. No have worries. you seen the car before? No, no. Oh, my God. Yeah, I got a video of it um, when it got under the trailer. Okay. And then... Yeah, please look at it. Make okay. sure it's okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Thank you, sir. Oh, yes. Oh, my Lord. Oh my lord. Oh my god. Yeah, make sure it's all good. Yes, sir. Please. Uh, it's just me. Okay, you've got, let's see what we got here. Oh, no wheel locks. Can we do that? Do you know how to put the top back here? I do, yeah, yeah. That's you one do? thing that good. I do. Thank yeah. God. Because <laughs> that's hard. You don't know what you're doing. Let's see. And if not, look, it might fit in the front. to be part of it she can I don't want to like oh yeah no worries her. yeah she's, she's, she's okay so this is basically what's going on super super easy everything in this car is kind of I would say idiot proof in yeah, a way yeah. you've got nav you've also got Wi-Fi right do you want this on or do you not do you want me to take that oh uh, yeah you can take it off nice ASMR yeah <laughs> right your apps, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, what do you have, iPhone? iPhone, yes, iPhone, sir. so let's do that. Are your auto-cooled seats, auto-heated seats. Up here is going to be your lift, your front Ooh. camera. Oh, okay, gotcha. Oh, And cool. it's going to give you three angles, yeah. right? Front, left, right. This right here, this is the bad boy button. Your traction control off. <laughs> Look, I, that's, that, that does what it does. Some people love Controversial. it. Controversial. Yeah. Some people love it, some people hate it, right? It's a little bit right. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's whatever. You're used to it, though, huh? Yeah, I don't think I've ever gotten used to it. <laughs> up and down your brightness. Oh, wow. You can change how far you want it, right? Oh, Zoom in shit, on the people. that's crazy. It's crazy. You can see people. You can spy on people. Yeah. Literally, you can see them smoking, doing everything. Like, all their facial expressions. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty crazy. I always like to see regular mirror. Oh, okay, because gotcha. Because it's like, yeah, I know what's going on. Stick that in there. Let's see if it works. 
Oh, there it is. There you go, bro. There it is. Wow, that's awesome. I didn't know it came with this, too. The little 70th anniversary. Yep, and it's all stickered. Oh, it's got this condom on. <laughs> nice. Shall we, shall we yeah. pop the cherry? Let's do it. Oh, Lord. Nice, nice. Oh, that's clean. There you go. Got the competition, and you got the embossed. Oh, oh man. Sick. Oh, man. You did it right, man. Let's go. That's so yes. awesome. Yeah, leave your phone there. Right. Can't believe it, man. Can't believe it's finally mine. Hey, listen, shout out to Lesson Chevrolet, all right? I don't even want to give a shout out to the original dealership where I bought this car from because I had so many issues with them. I might make a whole other video about how shitty the process was, but these motherfuckers, I wish I bought it from them. Like, I wish I gave my money to this dealership right here. If you're in New Orleans, if you need a car from Chevrolet, please come here. Show this person some love. It says it's a family run dealership since 1930, bro. That's World War II type shit. So show some love. Lesson. These are the boys right here, 100%. Okay. Oh, this is a key tag, okay? Gotcha. So if you lose your keys, mm -hmm. they're gonna ask for this. If you lose your keys, mm -hmm. they're gonna have to rekey the whole car. Yeah, and it's like a hell of money. It's right? terrible. You got your blue stitch keyring to match your blue car. Oh, wow. That's cool. There it is. Hey, Lesson Chevrolet. Shout out. Man. <laughs> that they didn't. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it, dude. Absolutely. Thank you, thank you. I know it's a crazy wait, or it was a crazy wait when I ordered this. Is it really crazy in the audience? Nice. You if you want to see it, go to Lesson Chevrolet, bro. Same These man. guys will hook you up. Come on Absolutely. now. Sweet. Get it way faster than I did. Fuck you. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. This is nuts, man. Yeah, big shout out to Lesson, bro. So you can see I'm sweating like a dog. A pig? Do pigs sweat? That's like a common saying, huh? I'm really glad right now I do not have the Alcantara steering wheel. There's like a lot of suede, actually. There's like suede right here, suede on the headliner. This whole thing is suede. Look at the... Ooh, what the fuck? That shit's crazy, bro. This interior is actually kind of nuts. These buttons, I didn't think I would like them. I'm already used to them. It's been 10 seconds. The buttons are nice. I will say the clickiness is nice. Come over here to the click. Come over here to the click. Nice, good click. This is like, oh shit. The sensors work. Let's go. <laughs> oh, Jesus, Nissan. Please don't do it. Oh, we already scraped, boys. Our first scrape ever. Not even a mile into the car. What's the point of the front lift? I didn't even fucking use it. What am I doing? Uh, we're gonna get food real quick. I gotta go get a tip for this guy because he's so dope. I'm literally gonna pay him just for like being so cool because he's go to Lesson Chevrolet is what I'm trying to say. All right. The blue seat belts. Put on your seatbelt, dude. Open the door, babe. You just gotta open it, bro. What? What do you mean? Just open the door, man. <laughs> Just grip it like you would open the door, you know? What do you mean? Where's your thumb at? It is not? Hey. What the fuck? <laughs> it is kind of weird. <laughs> yup. Last stop in New Orleans. Gonna go back to Houston right after this or go back to Texas in general, so. It's so hot in the car. I didn't want my turps to melt. So. Oh, hey. What's up, dude? What's up? You're, um, wait, wait. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. <laughs> I just literally watched it the other day. Hold on. Hey, 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 what's up, man? Roll, Good to meet you, bro. Roll, roll, <laughs> Hell yeah. Damn, Creole jambalaya red beans and rice. Come on with the deck. That's called doing New Orleans right. I'm down, Uzi. All right, after driving, uh, what, 20 miles? 20 miles, first impressions. Um, The sound system is fucking insane. Easily the best sound system I've had in a car ever. This Bose 18 speaker, whatever they got going on. Apparently it's the most speakers they've ever put in a two-door car ever. And you can feel it. The vi the windows vibrate. The door shakes. It's awesome. Pulled up to the dealership real quick to give my homie uh, a couple something. Just this dealership is so dope. I had to show at least a little bit of love. Please, if you guys are in the area, if you're just across the country and you want a Corvette, come to Lesson or talk to them. They'll get you right, bro. 100%. Alrighty, we are uh, 174 miles into the car now. Little piss break. I've been in these seats for two and a half hours straight, and they're pretty chill. It is also not that hard to get in and out of this thing at all. Like, people were talking about the bolstering on here. It's, it's pretty fat right here, but my M3 seats are way harder to get in and out of. These are the competition seats right here, which are a little tiny bit step above of the GT2 seats, and people were saying all online that they're super uncomfortable, that they're like only for track use, and if you're driving for more than a couple hours you're not gonna like it but honestly like i don't know i feel like a lot of the hoopla and like controversies are from let's be honest like corvette owners typical they're like 60 years old they have back pain and back troubles like any car would hurt their back for a couple hours you know pretty easy to get in right sure okay 
<laughs> Made a little stop in Rain, Louisiana. They're saying this is the frog capital of the world. I don't even know what that means, but in front of this McDonald's, there's a little frog in a McDonald's shirt. It's pretty cool. So there's a, there's a store over here and it's called Frog City. They might just sell frogs. I don't know what's going on here, but we're gonna get a coffee so I don't fall asleep on the rest of the drive. We got like two and a half more hours to Houston. Um, I wanna stop at Bucky's. If you know, you know. First drive through, McDonald's. That's classic. I'm fine with that. This guy, man. Happy birthday, Grimace. Frog murals, bro, on the highway. This is insane. I can't believe what I'm seeing right now. Where am I? Uh, we are in like the little comfort setting or whatever. And then uh, he also limits your revs to I think 4,000, maybe 4,500 RPM for the first 500 miles. So we got like 300 left. Is that an E63? That's a sexy whip. We have arrived, baby. You know where we're at. The backup camera is not as goaded as uh, the Europeans, I will say, but it's okay. I mean, Chevy did an okay job. Or GM, or whoever. Yes, what a little chime. That's nice. So getting in and out is definitely easier than my M3, but the seats are not as quality. As you can see, there's already kind of like markings in like, I didn't even, I'm not, bro, I weigh like 160 pounds, bro. It's kind of crazy how it's already so worn. Like, I know I was sitting here for five hours and such, and maybe it'll like, you know, buffing out or something, but my M3 has like 20,000 miles almost, and it does not have that much wear on the seat. So that's crazy. What the fuck? Oh, what the hell? There's no like, that's kind of awesome. There's no like thing you need to twist or take out. It's just, that's fire. Intense ASA. I'm gonna miss this when I take the car back to Cali, man, because we have only 91 and it's like five dollars plus. It's so stupid. Almost 400 miles. Got a, I mean, not that, not too shabby. We got a couple of uh, bugs killed and such. Here's the thing about the Corvette though, for some reason. So, this is like the radiator back there. As you can see, there's probably already like a nick or two in there, you know what I mean? I have no idea why Corvette has these so fucking large. Like, I can put my whole hand in here, bro. That's crazy. They do sell additional like inserts right here, which are much smaller, which I need to get. Um, I don't know why they sell them separately. It's like 400 extra dollars, but it should come automatically. It's so crazy how this is so fat right here. 15, 16 gallon tank, 50 bucks. God, I'm gonna miss this so much. If you don't live in Texas and you're not lucky enough to know what Bucky's is, it's like a fucking haunted pump gas station. That's also like a mega grocery store. They got their own like beef jerky and own little snacks and it's kind of insane. They got their own merch, bro. Come on now. The barbecue oh. section, bro. I love this place. I love Bucky's. They even got a bakery. Got that presence, man. I'm not even gonna lie. First remote start. I think that's how you do it. Oh, oh, dude, it does it fast. My Beamer takes like hella long to do. Let's go. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. It might be louder than my C63 was. I'm actually 100% sure it is, which is crazy. It's definitely louder than my M3. That thing sounds like dog shit, but like. It says full tank gives you about 382 miles, which is actually crazy impressive, but it's more close to like 340, 350. But uh, hey, that's that's like more or less equal to my BMW, which is an inline six compared to this fucking beast. Let's go. We are, oh, I didn't even, we're 100 miles away, bro, from being able to redline, I don't know if I want to redline it right away, but at least going above 4,000 RPM. So I'm really looking forward to making a quick stop, getting some wings, smack the puff real quick. If you know, you know. trunk is emptied out. The last thing that I want to do is try out the target top. I've never had a convertible car. Well, it's not a convertible, but I've definitely never had a car where the top comes off. So that's what we're going to do right now. This one. Did you do that over there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like towards you, not even. <laughs> I believe in you. Yeah. And then this right here. I think you just... Oh shit, wait. 
Oh, there we go. Just pressing the wrong thing. I'm a fucking idiot. You could just put some pressure right here. Oh, shit. It just lift. Oh, it's pretty light. It's a pretty light piece of thing. This is crazy. There's like a little latch right here and a latch right there, and they click in for these two places. Hell yeah. Oh, shit, yeah. This is sick! Let's go! I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'm gonna head home right now. Wish me safe luck. I probably made it if you saw the video. So it's gonna be it for me. Can't wait to get home, take a shower, sleep. It's gonna be so nice. Uh, more video. Con I'm gonna spam you guys uploads with this C8. I'm sorry I didn't really do that with the M3, but we're still working on it. But like, you're gonna see this car every fucking day. I hope you are excited for it just as much as I am. I love you all so much. I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe on those roads, all right? Peace.